Previously on Heroes of the Seasons, King Fringe became so strong he nearly defeated the party by spamming his OP Butt Slam skill. It was this point that I realized that stacking defense has decreasing returns compared to maximizing DPS, so I tried again with a more optimized build. Okay, so now we're gonna use stronger status ailment, so I'm definitely gonna need that accessory, huh? Assuming that's what they're talking about. More EXP with this mode as well. Okay, I'm just gonna try this overly uh, this non-support using build just for a heck of it, but this means I'll uh, if I run out of healing items, I'm kind of screwed. But the idea is that I, I have enough offense to uh, for uh, to kill off the enemy before that happens, but that might not be possible. Proceed to battle. Oh, off invasion mode, huh? Snowman sneeze? And what's this? What's going on? Who dares interrupt my ruining of Christmas? Lord Aldwall. I'll take it from here, French. It's high time I obliterate this holiday and turn it into ashes. Lord Aldwall, the biggest Christmas hare uh, in all the galaxies. I'll devour this holiday for good. Now run along, French, or I'll devour you as well. Alright, I'm out. What? Seriously? Oh boy. Yeah, I will snuff out the warmth of the season for good. Hmm, Lord Aldwall. His boundless hatred towards Christmas knows no bounds. That's what you're that's redundant sounding. I'll be fascinated to see how he fares. Oh no, it looks like we're being invaded by the biggest Christmas hare of uh, all the biggest Christmas haters. This isn't good. We have to protect the holidays at all costs. Sacrilegious. These otherworldly beings there invade the gods' world. What? Their dialogue changed! Adversary's not from this world, eh? Alien invasion is bad for business. Time to take care of this. Be careful, everyone. I'll try to keep the people in town safe. Ugh. Even with this crazy offensive build, man. Holy Bulwark. Oh boy. Target lock. Scatter shot! Damn, you survived it? Hmm. Didn't even get a full level from that. That's a lot. Okay. Oh man, I am actually running low on resources. Might be. Okay, leveled up. This is so jank, seriously. <laughs> Having two offensive people. Oh, that's a large crowd. Good thing I leveled up and got my resources refilled, but still, not good. I don't know if this is a good idea, because in those videos, Barry had... They already had really good gear that allows them to one-shot a lot of the weaker mobs. But I don't have such gear, so this might be a mistake. I may have to retreat and just redo the whole thing with a normal par a party. A balanced party. I don't know. Hmm... Ugh, there's still a lot. Ba barrier? What's the, the... The fuck does that do? Nullifies damage? Okay, woke up. Good. So I guess I just use twin slash. Yup. There. Boss approaching. 
No heal, no natural healing. Three actions in one turn? Are you serious? <sighs> I'm screwed. Unbreakable, immune to all ailments, three turns. So I won't be able to use poison. Someone already had to use an auto life? No. I, I still have it. Okay. That's good. That's a relief. Anyways, play dirty is useless. Twin slash spam. Okay. Stan, I... Uh, how's you doing on taunting? You still got two turns, so uh... Might as well just use a gingerbread cookie. Target locked. Paralyzed bullet should be useless at this point, right? Yeah, so in that case, I might as well just use... I don't know, actually. The debuffs count. They can't... Oh, the buffs still work. Good. That actually helps a lot. Surprising. Well, it didn't last very long, though. Damn. Okay, you just use a normal attack. And leveled up. Only level 3 after all of that, okay. Break time. What an awkward place to camp. we go. Before things get too bad, let's just use up a star cookie. I'm immune to Demi, fool. At least one of us is. Always a lot. No. Scatter. Full work. Mm. Judgment. Oh no. I'm glad she- her instant actually does damage. Oh. There. Shit, I'm low on MP. Why? Oh. 
reflection. Okay. Good, we leveled up off that. Boss, uh... We have literally every status effect, okay? I'm in all positive states, including- Oh, no! That's terrible. I'm not getting enough attack to- I don't have any way to deal with the attack to buff either. This is getting ridiculous. Now the enemies aren't taking enough damage, so I'm screwed. Can I still use Holy Bulwark? I guess I can. Oh man. Reflection. We are so horribly debuffed, too. This is just like with... Oh. Instant use, you say? Does not remove curse though, that sucks. Nor does it it did remove the stat down, so that's actually helpful to some extent. Oh my goodness. But you're almost dead. A few more snowman sneezes and I'll sneeze you out of existence. So close, damn it.
We still have the taunt, so uh just use some candy cane. Aha! Gotcha this time. Okay, now I got their first new skills. Nice, nice. They're faster than me! Oh man. Star Cookie! Damn it, even with the taunt, Joanna is way more aggro for some reason. Damn. Not looking good. Danger stance, no. If I use dancing star, he probably dies. Oh no, he didn't, but he still got countered pretty hard there. Yeah, that's it. Uh, this could be a b bad situation. Holy shit. Okay, their counterattack wore off, so I can start killing you off. These level ups are so meager. Of truth. All of them have danger stance. Cursed already? Seriously? Man.
Yeah, this counterattack gimmick can be so annoying. So this defend for now. I'll soften you up for next turn. Okay, good. Leveled up. Oh no, boss. Oh. <sighs> Wait, I didn't refill on Snowman Sneeze. The heck? Oh, shoot. I guess I own. Uh, Snowman Sneeze is, uh, does not. Uh, yeah, I, I don't think I can buy those at the shop. Shoot. Cursed? Seriously? This is getting ridiculous. You don't have a counter bu buff yet, so I'm I'm still safe in that regard. There, that will lower your offense a tad. Man. Mirror reflect. Oh, it, it reflects the siphoning too. Shoot. Did not realize that. Can't even recast Holy Bulwark. Oh my goodness. We are so close to death, though. There. Victory's a victory. Ow. Light Seal Divine Intervention, Skybreaker Superhuman Reflex, Lethal Shooter, Barrage in the Face. All right. Can they really beat this boss with, without a support character? With just with two freaking glass cannons?
Oh man. Oracle. First blood. Let's go cost some MP, but it'll be worth it. Oh no, he he has the exact counter he needs against me. That that's gonna suck. Okay, seriously. Yeah, the problem with counter stances is that they last. Uh, if, is that they'll just always get recasted instantly, so that will leave me no openings to actually do anything. Seriously. I wish there was a way to take off enemy counterattack buffs. But there doesn't seem to be one. That didn't do any damage. Doesn't even target the guy who has aggro. Yeah. Oh no, he he actually lost it. Shoot. Okay. Now that you have no counter attack, I should kill you. Okay. Paralyzing bullet. Poison and stun. That'll give me some time. <laughs> yes. Progress has been made. Silence you, haha. Yes, I won! Even with a glass cannon team, that was actually poorly matched against the boss in many ways. Wait, why am I getting experience? Shoot, is Fringe going to attack me after this? That's not good. Fringe is totally good. Final boss is approaching? What do you mean I have to fight two bosses back to back? What? Oh no, this guy's the boss, Lord Aldwall. You miserable fools, you surely believe you can take me. I'm the devourer of holidays and the destroyer of Christmas spirit. <laughs> oh no, he debuffed my attack too. <sighs> Seriously, now even the final boss phase has multiple battles.
Wait, that didn't count as instant on short. Okay, so siphon energy. Okay. Damn it. I, I'm not gonna win at this rate. It's impossible. Even with auto life, it might not be possible to win. The enemies are gonna keep me in a constant state of being debuffed, and I can't deal with that. <laughs> Doom, are you serious? My goodness, we're screwed. There. Some leeway has been obtained. Okay, but this guy I cannot deal with yet. So I have Doom, that's not good. Does the Doom stats still persist? Oh, fuck. Oh my goodness. That didn't do enough. Having unbreakable as well? Seriously, what the hell is this design? Man. Oh no, she lost her auto life. Fuck. But this guy cannot defend anymore.
you. I'm going to silence you. No, wait, you're immune to it. Oh my gosh. Who's inflicted with what? There, downed. There, target locked. Paralyzing bullet to reduce your offenses. Can I have a turn yet? Holy moly. Fuck off. Don't need a supporter. I uh, I am my own best supporter. 30k vice. That's unboosted by the way. I didn't equip the gift card because there's just no more room for error anymore. Arg, no, this is impossible. Arg, and guess what? I have to do this two more times to get more characters, I guess. Please tell me Fringe isn't going to show up and just attack me out of nowhere just to, while I'm tired. That would be so bad. Everything's back to normal. Woohoo, Christmas is safe from the invaders. Hooray, you guys did it. Christmas is saved. You're alive. Of course we are. We won't be able to do it without our heroes of Christmas. Nice going, everyone. <laughs> Invasion badge. 10... Uh, uh, 100k. Oh, that's actually a lot. That's... Might almost be worth it. Lunetta the tank. Okay, two more mercenaries. Oh, no. Invader skull. Ribbon of love. Oh, new accessories. Invasion mode plus. I'm not doing that yet. Access the gift shop on all modes. Buy new decorations. Okay. Thank you for helping us, heroes. Until next time. Merry Christmas. Vespiana has heard my prayers. We shall continue to prevail. Happy holidays, I guess. Good, I can start a new business with this. More passive income for the holidays. Oh, taking you back to the mercenary select screen. Okay. What's this new accessory? Invader Skull. Just a huge... Buff to all stats, huh? And Ribbon of Love. Protect from cursed status. May want to consider swapping out one of the burgers on him for that, huh? Yeah. Is Invader Skull farmable? If so, I might be able... Maybe if I play Invasion Mode enough, can I just farm a lot of these to just get really high stats? What is this gift shop? We have brand new goodies, but you can buy for your, for your presents. I see. Wait a minute. These are consumables. And, and armor. Okay, Elrond the Nuker. Hmm, one more mercenary, huh? Wait, I didn't get any accessories. I guess those are one-time accessories. Shoot. Okay, now I have Theodore support type. Okay, that's all free for this mode. Thank you for helping us, heroes. Until next time, Merry Christmas. 
That's all the mercenaries, actually. Gus Vienna has heard my prayers. Okay. And that means there wouldn't be much point to completing the error mode multiple times unless they actually gave me the special equipment each time. But I think these, the special equipment is a one-time only thing. Alright, I have three sets of hero armor, so while I'm at I might as well just buy the rest of the current decorations. Okay, that's a lot of stuff filled up. Hopefully no one got stuck inside the RTP. No collision detection. Hmm, I'm not as religious as most people, but I'm grateful that Christmas is one of God's Vienna's blessings to Vian. Ah, uh, Mayor, every season is a blessed celebration under her divine gaze. Note your hard work in preserving the Christmas spirit is enough to devotion to the goddess. I'm so tempted to peek into the presents. Please don't meet me, they have to be a surprise. I do my best to aim accurately when shooting with my gun get and getting the best business deals. So I sense your anxiety. You should probably stop worrying too much about things you can't control. You're right, Arthas. There's just so much in my head right now. So much on your mind. I've been eating too much sugary treats. Ugh. I told you not to let me influence you. Alright, let's test out some of the new characters on easier difficulties. Lunetta the Vampire is a tank. Time to sink my claws in these haters and drink their blood! <coughs> uh. Okay, who else was there? Theodore. Healing and multi-target. Force damage. Psychic. I can hear your thoughts. I heard that you believe my ability to, uh, in my ability to defend Christmas, as you should. Theodore has been hired. Hmm. Elrond and Nuker. Arcane type. Higher. Christmas is calling my magic. Could there be some esoteric knowledge hidden in this holiday? Okay, let's try the Mountain Jam mode. Hope they're ready for my magic. I want them to scream for me. I can sense their inadequacy from a mile away. Okay. Mind Pulse Instant Cast. Attack based. He, so he uses a mix of magic of int and attack. That's so weird. That could make... If they have to use both stats, that can make building them more difficult because then they wouldn't be able to specialize in just one stat. Okay. So the only equipment I have is making it slightly faster. Ivory. Vampiric Assault. Elrond, you seem to be contemplating something. Oh, it's nothing, Marinelli. I'm just curious why most people have collectively decided to celebrate during this time of the year. Is there something about the stars lighting during this season that makes people festive? I honestly don't know. All I know is that people use this season to find joy and come together. I feel like the lore behind this is that someone from Earth got Issa Kaiden and, and, and spread their traditions or something. I see, forgive me. I'm just, I was just curious about this holiday's origins. It's quite a brilliant time, I must say. No worries at all. Yeah, that's usually how they ex explain things like that, usually through either isekai or time travel. Mayor, I'm always up for a little festive chaos, but do t uh, but tell me, do you have any friends on the menu for tonight? We're not buying any of my friends, Lunetta. We're here to protect Christmas. You're taking all the fun out of it, but fine. For Christmas, I'll resist my urges. Just point me to the naughty list, and I'll make sure they have a chilling holiday. Lunetta, we're not making a literal naughty list. Let's focus on saving the holidays. Holiday is blood. It's all the same to me. But if you say so, Mayor, let's keep this ho Christmas wholesome, shall we? You can just eat French. Theodore. Theodore, your psychic skills are a great boon to help defend Christmas. Hmm, defend Christmas is an interesting endeavor. What's the plan after this? We'll spread joy, handle gifts, and maybe organize a festive parade. It's all about lifting spirits. Your thoughts are very loud while you were speaking. Do you truly think your friend Mimi is such a killjoy? 
Wait, what? How do you... Oh, right. Well, maybe you told me many times to keep my excitement about the holidays to myself. I wonder why she would tell you that. Do you guys celebrate Christmas where you're from? Yes, we hold a festival at Nuiska Village during this time of the year. We don't call it Christmas. We call it the Day of the Fallen Star. Legend has it that a wondrous star that brings good omen has fallen near our village during this time of the year a long time ago. Well, that's a very interesting story for your holiday's origins. It's almost the same as ours. It was to celebrate the rise of a silver star called Christ. It's fascinating how our holiday's origins have a connection with a star. Tell me about it. Hmm. Lunetta. Mira, I can be good when the occasion calls for it, but don't expect me to give up all of my vices. I appreciate your cooperation, Luna. Now let's focus on protecting the village, most especially the decorations and the Christmas tree. If there, that tree has been night, I might just give a little nibble. Luna, we're protecting the tree, not snacking on it, and it's also not- it, it doesn't even have blood. You're no fun, Mira. I've been snacking on everything that has some veins on it ever since I was a little boy. A little boy? Yes, and now I'm a grown lady, but you get what I mean, wink. Oh, I see now. Peter, I have this feeling there are enemies hiding in that bush over there. What do you think? Let me tune in. Oh yes, I sense thoughts of mischief and green fur. They're preparing to strike anytime soon. Oh, look at that. The, that bush just moved unnaturally. Incredible. You really sense them. It's all about reading between the lines, or in this case, between the thoughts. You're like our holiday detective. Alright, what am I thinking now? You're wondering if cheddar popcorn count as a proper dinner. Really, Mayor? Hey, you got me. Tell you what, Elrond, why don't you celebrate Christmas Eve with us after this? And I promise to celebrate the day of the Fallen Star with you in your, uh, in your village next year. That would be brilliant, Mayor Nelly. As keen as I am to enjoy your holidays preparations after this, I'm also looking forward to have you celebrate next year of ours. Awesome, I wonder how your people celebrate your holidays during this season. We celebrate by recognizing the magic present everywhere around us. We have events focused on using our magics to create beautiful fireworks and conjure delicious treats. Do you just say, conjure delicious treats? You mean you don't need to cook them? An adept mage can conjure edibles. Yes, I can do that as well if you like. Please, you conjure some of your culture's delicious treats for us this Christmas Eve. Say no more. Hey. <laughs> well, yeah, once we're do done saving Christmas, I'd like to invite you for Christmas Eve dinner. Christmas, uh, Christmas Eve dinner, you say? Will there be tasty treats? Of course, there'll be snacks and refreshments. Nothing too exotic, though. You sure about that? Are you guests on the menu? Lunana, no snacking on the townsfolk, please. All right, Mirror, I'll behave. Peter, once we're done saving Christmas, I'd love for you to join us for Christmas Eve. Your mind ring abilities could make it a unique and fun gathering. Christmas with a telepathic touch. I suppose I could add a dash of mind reading to entertainment to the festivities. Perfect, it'll be ju great. Just imagine the joy when people unwrap their presents, and you already know what's inside. Oh, the anticipation of surprise is ruined. How delightful. You're such a party pooper, Theodore. I'll consider your invitation, but no promises on keeping everyone's secrets safe. Okay. Mind Pulse. And also Crimson Cube. Oh, I should use that first since it's an int buff. Whoops. Sonic Blast. Silence. Bloodlust. Counterattack rate. Empiric Assault. Hmm. Ancient Seal. Stunned you, Gus. Hmm. Okay. Can't use that multiple times in a row. Terror of the Night. Toxicity or Vampiric Assault. Maybe we should test this against normal mode. 
No, this can't be. I can't take any more of this. No! Griffiths has, has, has taught me a lot of things. It's quite a magical holiday. Griffiths' treats are nice and all, but I prefer something with some fresh meat on it. The might shall always overpower any obstacles. Okay, back to Mercenary Select. Thanks for tuning in to this Let's Play of Heroes of the Seasons. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, and or hit the bell icon.